Good morning, everyone. Today is Sunday. Oh, that's bright. Um, it is eight o'clock, and Kaylee's still asleep. Everyone else is awake. Um, I am feeling much better today than I was yesterday. So I'm up. I made some apple cinnamon baked oatmeal for breakfast. Um, I think it's funny if you look at my wild hair and look at this. Look up here at Mama. Nina, stop it. This girl's wild hair, very similar. You need to go outside. Come on, let's go outside. Um, Anyway, the girls get their wild hair from their mama for sure. Go, go. Get outside. Get outside. Go. No, go. That dog, she worries. She's terribly worried that the cats are going to eat her food. Okay, so we are awake this morning. The kids are making crafts. Kyla May had a dream. Alexa, pause. Kyla May had a dream about making crafts on paper plates, didn't you? Yeah. And so she got up this morning. I used to do this back when I was probably like six. Yep, she used to do it a lot a few years ago, but since she had a dream about it, she got up first thing this morning and got out paper plates to make some crafts. So they're crafting. Oh, you guys Kendon. doing that? Kenan, what are you coloring? Just a puppy yeah. dog book? And then it's color and puppy dogs. They miss it. What are you doing? Mom, watch oh. this. Ready? Ready? Can work? Oh, you're smearing it. It works on the front. That's because the front has some wax on it. Yeah. Just make sure you wash your hands when you're done. Mom, look. I'll make. Um, she had it all over her fingers and she went like this and touched her lips. Uh -oh. And she had black lips. Uh -huh. And like this and then she got Stop! Stop! Stop. Stop. Some, some kids couldn't wait for oatmeal to get done so they had cereal this morning. That's on me, Mom! I'm waiting! So, today's Sunday. We're not going to go to church today because I have not been feeling well. There are several people from church that are sick, and um, I just think it would be best for us to stay home. So we're going to stay home, and um, I had planned on for our trip going to the grocery store after church today. Wait, church? We're going to church? Well, no, we're, I said I had planned on it. Oh. <laughs> but since we're not going to church, we may end up just going to the grocery store once we get to where we're going. What do you need? Mama, mama, look. Can we all go with? Hang on. Yeah. So um, today we'll spend. I'll probably do some prep cooking. Um, probably, but not all together. I don't think. You just have to take one at a time. I might take two at a time. We'll probably do some prep cooking today. I've got a few freezer meals I want to get made to take on our trip with us so that we have easy meals um, to cook while we're gone and I don't have to spend a ton of time cooking. So that's what my plans are for today. All right, we just finished our church time. We just watched an online service from another church. Um, so we did that. The trash guy came while we were watching our sermon. So we had to pause and go run out there and make sure we had all the trash in the trash can. And now everyone oh, is running around oh, my, my water. getting their energy my out. Uh, they're all outside playing and, huh? Yeah, get it, get it wet a little, get a little bit. Um, Cadence and I are going to make some lunch. It's about 11.40. So I'm not sure what I'm going to cook for lunch yet. I need to go find something to cook. So I'm gonna go search through the cupboards. I haven't been very good at meal planning lately. I just have been cooking whatever I feel like or I've been sick for three days so my husband's and my daughter's been cooking for me. But Cadence wants to help make lunch today. How many? 
What do you think we should make, Kate and Top? Um, pizza. Uh, I don't think we're gonna make pizza. Go check. <laughs> <laughs> we need something easy. Oh, we don't have any. French like macaroni bread. and cheese. We might make macaroni and cheese. That's pretty easy. Think that would be good. Um, how about spaghetti? Well, I was waiting for spaghetti. We're gonna have spaghetti on our trip. Mm, okay. And then, yeah, I guess macaroni and cheese. Now let's go look in the fridge and see what we got in there. Okay, we're gonna find something for lunch. Okay, we're gonna have macaroni and cheese for lunch. And while we're waiting for our water to boil, I'm making some um, breakfast freezer meals. So I had, I got this stuff out before I got sick a few days ago to thaw, so it's just been sitting in the refrigerator. Now that I feel better, we're gonna go ahead and cut these up and make them. So I'll show you what I'm doing. Okay, so these are those pork sausage patties that I was talking about in my food bank haul and in my food storage um, that people were upset about. I said my kids don't enjoy eating these all by themselves plain and people got mad about that. Um, but we do enjoy them being made into like biscuits and gravy or today we're gonna cut them up and put them in our breakfast casserole and have them that way. So Cadence is gonna help me. Go ahead and cut, cut that up there. What is? Go ahead and cut it. You know, just, let me see what's wrong with these things here. I think maybe. Scissors just don't want to work very good, do they? Okay, so you can take some of those out, and what we're going to do is we're going to cut them into small chunks. So you cut them like this first, into strips. And we cut them the other way. And then we're going to turn them this way, and we're going to cut them this way, into little pieces like that. Okay? And I'm going to get a pan out and we're going to brown these. After we get them chopped up, we're going to brown them in a pan. So I'm going to get a big pan out so we can put them in there. So after you chop them, bring them over and put them in this pan here, okay? Be very careful, sweetheart, that they're really sharp. Really you don't have to go back and forth. You just have to push. Okay, so don't chop, don't slice back and forth, just push down. There you go, yep. There, good job. Okay, next thing I'm gonna do, um, I've got my bowl here, I put Oh, my hash browns in there. <laughs> they kind of look gross. <laughs> they look like little worms. Yeah. Uh, but I've got those in there. <laughs> and I'm going to crack, start cracking eggs into my bowl. Austin okay. found an egg nest out in the combine. So he brought all those eggs in, but I don't know which ones they are in the refrigerator. So I'm having to test every egg before I crack it into the bowl. You float them, or you put them in a bowl of water. If they float, they're bad. If they lay on their side at the bottom, they're freshest. If they stand upright, they're still good, but a little bit older. And if they float, then they're yucky. So I'm gonna test out some eggs. I'm gonna do every single one before I crack them in because I do not want to crack a rotten egg into the bowl. It will be disgusting. So I'm gonna start cracking those eggs. What are you making? Macaroni and cheese. And we're making some egg casseroles for the freezer to take with us. Oh, that guy's bad. He's floating, see? Floating egg. Got one bad one, he's floating. Put this one. Put it in there. Put it in here. Put it in, see if it floats. Nope, sunk. Say sunk. Can I 
Drop it gently, gently. No, 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 we're not cracking it. We're setting it in there to see if it sinks or if it floats. If it sinks, then it's a, it's a good egg that we can cook it. Oh, see that one floated. See it floating? That means it's a yucky egg. We don't want to cook it because it's a yucky one, okay? Water's boiling. We're gonna put our mac and cheese in. And did you take the cheese out of there? Oh, sorry. Gotta take the cheese packet out, silly goose. <laughs> and then Kaden's cut up our sausage over here. So I'll get that cooking too. Or she turned it on for me. Pause. I've got it connected on my phone. Alexa, see. Pause. Yeah, she won't pause. I have to put it, have to pause it over here. Oh, it did work. Okay. So our friend from church, he makes music. So we were listening to his Christmas album, which is kind of fun. Um, he does a lot of, well, he does everything on the song. He does the instruments and the singing and everything. And he does some acapella songs, which is really cool too. Um, okay, so what I'm doing now, I'm going to make some chili and spaghetti sauce, just the sauce for our trip. I am um, getting those ready to go. I gotta run out and get another package of hamburger from the freezer out in the Quonset. But I'm gonna get those mixed up. Those are gonna be two of our meals while we're gone. One of the ways that we um, make it a little bit cheaper to go on vacation and go places, no, Gilly, you go outside, is by, um, first off, we're staying at an Airbnb, which is a tiny bit more, well, not really, a tiny bit more expensive than a hotel, but the hotel was only for one room, and there are 10 of us, and one room does not work very well for 10 of us. So we're staying at the Airbnb, which is cheaper than paying for two hotel rooms, and we have a full kitchen. Um, so we'll be eating breakfast, lunch, and dinner at our Airbnb, which saves us a ton of money on our trip, um, so that we're not spending so much at restaurants. Can I get the rooster? No, you can't get the rooster. Because, so that's one of the ways we are able to go on a vacation. Um, we, we save a lot of money that way doing Airbnb or we have a uh, like 
vacation condo place that we could go to, but they don't have one at the place we're going. So, um, stay at the Airbnb and eat breakfast, lunch, and dinner at the at the house. Okay, I'm getting all this meat cooked up in here. I just had this brilliant thought that I don't have to mix the chili up before I put it into the freezer bag. So I'm gonna open up my cans of stuff that I have here and dump those into my freezer bag and then when my meat is done, I will just put that in the bag with all the other stuff. So it's extremely hard to believe it's December with this weather we've been having. It's so warm in the sunshine. You are a dirty cat. Look at you. You are so dirty. You've been rolling in the dirt, haven't you? You dirty mess. You dirty cat. I noticed the kids out here. I showed you this in another vlog. We had... Okay, okay. Piles of manure could be so fun. I know. I know, they're so fun. Alright, it is dinner time now. Um, I'm trying, I was cleaning up. I left a big pile of stuff on the floor. I have in my instant pot, I put in there about 40 minutes ago, those two. Um, corned beefs that I got out of the freezer. I put both of those in there to cook. They were still partly frozen. Um, so I put them both in to cook for an hour and a half. And they should be done by the time the timer beeps. Let's see what they're doing out here. You're naked. Looks like we got a lot of work going on out here. Austin spread out the manure with the tractor. And now they're scooping it up to take it around the yard, I guess, probably. Hi. Hi. That made it easy, huh? Yeah, nice to have a tractor to do that with. Got all flattened out. Yeah. Carrington was sad though that you were flattening it out because she couldn't play on it anymore. That I was what? That you were making it flat because she couldn't play on it anymore. Oh. <laughs> nice one, Crispin. Crispin the same way. Yeah. Had your nice big pile and knocked it all off your shovel. What? Said I saw that you knocked it all off your shovel. <laughs> How thick do you think it is? Huh? How thick do you think it is? Oh, over here it's probably about a foot and a half deep. Uh huh. And then on the average, probably a foot, a foot and a half, somewhere there deep. Yeah. Is that, are you going to leave it there or are you going to scoop some off? No, I'm, this is what I'm going to do is go along. I'm going to put this out across our grass all over. Yeah. This Sounds good. This hasn't been fertilized like this for. Oh, okay. Yeah. Biddy, good job. Whoa, Biddy, nice one. Good job, Carrington. Yeah, let's go in and we'll get some. Mama, 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 
with our dinner. It is 6.43. There's still a lot of chores that need done though. What? Kaylee needs to wash all the big dishes still. Yeah, and she's, I bet So, everyone's brushing their teeth. We're getting ready to head downstairs um, and watch Mandalorian. So, thanks for hanging out with us today. Hope you enjoyed watching. If you did, don't forget to give me a thumbs up. And if you're not subscribed yet, make sure you hit that subscribe button so you can see more videos in the future. Talk to you later. Bye.